Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor, and I'm going to show you one of my favorite assets from the Unity Asset Store. And I purchase a lot of assets with my own money if I find them really useful. This is a really nice way to add some life to environments or terrains that are purposely static. Yes, you can have some wind, but bird flock is a really nice way. This developer has loads of assets with different styles of birds, which do the same flocking behavior. Whether you want to create a wild flock, whether you want to some to fly around a specific area, change the size, you can just drop the prefab in and it'll take you two minutes to set up. And it's so, so easy and awesome. So here I am in my scene here and I have imported the unlock software's bird flocking and you can see inside the flock sparrow package which i've got here you've got different examples you've got an example where you can get birds to avoid specific obstacles as long as they've got a particular layer so they never actually collide with something that you don't want them to we've got a free roam example where they'll just roam around a specific area over and over. We've got an ultra sync set where they will follow different paths and just follow around as if they were flocking or flying to a specific destination. We've got a wild type which will follow different directions collectively, sometimes do swarming variations, and they'll just break up and make lots of variation with the actual movements that they do. And also check out Unity's massive mega bundle that's out this current moment and all the rest of the savings in the links down below. And be sure to check out my Patreon to get access to over 185 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Now, when I'm in my scene here, which I've got a terrain, I quite liked the bird flock controller wild. And when I drop the item in my scene, you can see it here. You might need to reposition it to exactly where you want it to be. And I've just dropped this into my scene and you can see the birds randomly flying around exactly like I wanted and I've done no customization for this to happen. And then you've got lots of settings for the flock properties. So you can set a different prefab of if you've got a different bird, you can set the roaming area, which is this light blue square. You're gonna be able to set where they can actually roam around in. You could set the amount of birds. You could set the flock width, which is how big or how wide each of the actual flock that they are, how much they're going to flock around. Then you've got any offsets and you can actually run a script so every other frame is dropped so you can increase performance. You can increase the bird's speed so you vary how slow and fast some of them will be, some of them won't all be the same. You can have how much they will dive at any particular point. Well, how, what the chances of them actually diving at the current moment it was zero how much chance there is for them to source or go higher. Lots of different sizes, so you can vary, so you can then vary with the bird min max scale. And in this case, you can trigger random waypoints if you tick this box. So you'll be able to see as they're moving around, as we've got a waypoint that's randomly selected and they will move to those waypoints that actually exist. So they're always actually moving to a different area then you can set some delay on the waypoints. Then you can look at the animations to be able to, if you've got different animations for different types of birds, you've got avoidance, so you can click to avoid and you can void everything on a particular layer and how much to avoid them by. So you always keep a specific distance if you're looking to avoid buildings, as in the example, and you can make sure that they stick in a group. So be sure to check this out and let me know what you think. Be sure to check down all the links in the description for the best sales, savings and the massive mega bundle that's on the Unity store at the moment. And be sure to come and check out my Patreon to get access to over 185 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. And be sure to check out all my assets on the Unity Asset Store and on my website for massive savings. So thank you so much for watching. Big thank you to all my patrons and a massive thank you to Peter Steiner and all of the rest of the supporters. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.